Does my head look chopped off? Hey everybody, welcome to Comida Caliente. I'm here with Ambrosia. And today we're going to show you our dark lip colors. I have here, I don't know because I can't see the bottom. Rebel. <laughs> <laughs> this is Rebel by MAC. And I'm nervous because I don't feel like I look good in dark blue colors, so I'm kind of excited and nervous. But we'll see. Let's go. That one looks red. It's pretty though. Well, it looks again like the wine one. Yeah. Right? Like a fuchsia wine. But I swear it looks it looks like it would come on as purple. Like, like dark purple. Dark purple. It's kind of making my teeth look. Look, it kind of makes my teeth look yellow. Yeah, it does. Mm -hmm. Like, uh, it looks like I drank too much red wine <laughs> and my lips are stained. <laughs> but this one looks amazing. When I do dark colors, I don't do blush. Mike's doing it good. Not so much on this one, but that one is nice. <laughs> look, at this time, it, I like all the colors. And yeah, I liked all the bright. <laughs> you really like all the dark. I already knew that. I told you before we started. I was like, I don't know. I'm scared. I don't look good in dark. I'm I say, like, oh. nah. <laughs> like my luscious lips. <laughs> you know how to get rid of your stain? How? Just, lemon juice? Oh, lemon juice? I don't know. It's me. <laughs> At nighttime, I'll put like a layer of Vaseline on top of my lips. Like that's not really good to go to sleep in, but put Vaseline on there, and then within like 30 minutes, you can take a cloth and wipe it, mm. and then you'll see like this thick layer. I think it's like an exfoliation. You ever find that you hold on to a lipstick but you have it for so long because you don't think it's gonna look good, and then like years later when you finally try it, you love it? Yeah, that's my lipstick drawer is like that. <laughs> All of mine are looking the same. I think the, I think your lips are just staying. <laughs> but is it, I see shimmer. Yeah, it is a little shimmery. I like it. It feels like a wine color. I think we've learned a, a lesson today that we're just buying the same the lipstick. <laughs> so maybe we should stop buying lipstick. <laughs> this is a good um, everyday lipstick, it I is. think. Like you could throw this on with anything. Cause it's, it's going well with my colors, but I think it would look nice on you as well. This looks like a dark version of what we shot in the other video. Yeah. It looks like that same. I need to get out of the box, I guess. What are some things that you put on your lips to keep the lipstick stay like longer. A liner. You can fill your lips in with a liner that's like nearly the same color as whatever lipstick that you wore. I really haven't bought a liner since like eighth grade. Make sure you exfoliate because the main reason why it fades away is because our lips are like not yeah, able to like layer. soak it in. Yeah, we oh, have that extra okay. layer over there. Okay. This is Revlon Color Burst and it's a matte balm. Mm -hmm. And what's, is that the name? Um, the name is, this is Shameless. This is a Frost by MAC. <laughs> and the name, I like the, <laughs> I'm so scared. I've never worn a Frost by MAC. <laughs> what is the name? Shrin I want to say it was called Strain. Strain? But it's kind of scratched off. I don't know. Let me see. <gasps> you like it? You need I that color. I, need, I know, I'm like, I think I like this color. This color officially looks awful. I think you could rock it out. I mean, I would do it. <laughs> You'd be like, I would do it. It's a little more dramatic here. I look like right. from, from Texas. <laughs> <laughs> My hair in a bun, some purple ass lips. Oh, so you're born in Texas? Mm -hmm. Houston. Well, Baytown's like right outside of Houston. Wow. All right, well, those were the dark colors. If you want to check out the light colors or bright colors, you can go to Ambrosia's page and um, tell us what you think. Yep. And from, from our, our casa, casa to yours, comida caliente. caliente. <laughs>